makes a good photograph? One of the key ingredients in any good photograph is light. In order to see your subject, you need proper lighting. Often outdoor lighting can be the best since it's brighter than most lights. However, there are aspects of lighting that you will want to consider when shooting your subject. Make sure the light is in front of your subject and not behind it. The angle of the light is equally important. You can create a dramatic effect by having part of the subject's face in shadow. Low lighting can be used for a dramatic effect. Using the light at different angles or catching the light at the edge of a subject can add interest and beauty to the image. Many times in 4-H, there's a story worth telling through images. At some, some of the events and contests, there are photos of the winners with their ribbons. But if while you're at an event, you can capture something deeper with either the image telling the story or you adding an account of the, of the image you captured. For instance, in this photograph of some 4-H boys standing around talking over a top of rocket parts at an aerospace event, there are many potential great shots to be taken from the blasting off of rockets. Still, this shot is about a group of kids who love math so much they are each trying to one-up each other with math problems. That is the kind of story donors, educators, and parents love. So sometimes being in the right place at the right time is the key. Iconic images, interesting images, unexpected content, close-ups, details, can each lend themselves to the making of a successful image. A great image does not have to be in color. Black and white or single color images can have dramatic effect and leave a lasting impression. Likewise, action images create dramatic results and often 4-H'ers are demonstrating or competing so that capturing this kind of shot has potential. You can capture the image in the instance or with blur to add dramatic effect. Trying to get an unusual angle can help add interest to your shot. Sometimes placing yourself at a lower or higher position can capture a moment much better. Additionally, the subtle nuances of the crisp, clear details can add interest and polish to your image. Time of day can add emotion to a shot by how low or high the lighting is in the image. It is a good idea to try a technique or two and practice them. Think about where you are in relationship to what you're trying to capture. What and where is the lighting source? Can you add more light to a subject if it needs it? Hold your breath when you take the shot so that there is not any extra movement to cause blurring. Use a tripod if necessary. Think about ways to capture the moment that is not expected. But practice is the key and don't be afraid to try something new.